pressure safety valves, pressure relief valves, PSVs, PRVs are your protection. They are there to protect your plant. Normally, they're set at around 5 to 10% above the operating pressure of the plant. So that if your pressure of the plant runs at 100 bar, you'll set it at 110, something like this. And it gives you a safety gap that you can allow for little upsets in the plant without relieving everything. But after that, the pressure relief valve will lift and shut the plant down. These valves are a safety device. Therefore, they are critical to the operation. Therefore, they have certain legislation that goes with them. Normally, most countries follow the same thing, but you would need to check on your particular country, your particular client, what they require. Normally, six months before the start date, they must have been tested. So if you test a valve in January, you must start that plant before June. If the the start is delayed until September, October, you will have to retest all your valves. Once they're in operation, then it's either one year or two years they need to be tested. One very good tip to remember when you're doing your P&ID checks is look and see how many valves there are. If you only have one safety valve, how do you change it? Every equipment should have two so that you can put one online, have one on standby, and if you need to change one out and do a test, you can just change over the valves. You also need to make sure that all the valves are the lockable type because you don't want anybody that doesn't know what they're doing closing one by mistake. So you will have a position on the valve where you can put a padlock through it. That way you know that that valve is safe. And if you go into control rooms, you will always see a safety lock board and there will be hundreds and hundreds of keys on there all saying which lock they belong to on which part of the plant. It's a vital piece of safety equipment. Don't misuse it, don't abuse it, and don't forget it. It's there to protect you as much as the plant. Something goes wrong and the plant blows up, you're in danger. We can always build another plant. It's only money, but we can't build another you yet. We're getting there. They're doing transplants of heads and just about everything else. So maybe one day they're growing a a sheep from DNA. Maybe one day, but not just yet. So be careful.